The wait is over for the most anticipated collegiate bass fishing event of the year. The 2012 Boat US Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship is finally here. <laughs> 105 colleges from Division I to community colleges across the country. A total of 200 teams and 400 collegiate anglers compete. It's the biggest collegiate fishing event ever. This is basically their top plateau for them before they go out into the next step. I can't think of a better venue for this. It's always been the greatest tournament atmosphere that we go to each year. Oh my goodness, largest event in the series ever. The entire experience is first class. They're treated like touring professional. That's unbelievable. They're out here doing what they love to do. It's great to see you know, people following their passion. This year, we have a new battleground. Pickwick Lake, Florence, Alabama, the hottest lake for bass fishing, and it promises to be a slugfest. This is the biggest field we've ever had. I love this place. At this time of the year, you can fish deep, you can catch them shallow, and it's just awesome. Fish are way bigger, I mean, point blank. I mean, that's what we're out here looking for is those monsters. Welcome to the most prestigious collegiate fishing tournament in the U.S., the 2012 Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship. The Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship started in 2006 with only a handful of collegiate anglers and has rapidly grown to become the nation's largest collegiate bass fishing event. This year, the Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship gets even bigger with over 400 collegiate anglers, 200 teams, and over 20 big name sponsors. The actual competition days are two days away, but once these young men and women arrive in Florence, Alabama, they're treated as if they'd qualified for any other prestigious fishing championship. The fun starts with Yamaha Angler Appreciation Night. As a sponsor, last year when we attended, we wanted to step up the game, raise the bar just a little bit. So this year we came out and we decided to bring our demo boats out, our trailer, our service trailer, we set the whole thing up for the students. Not only could they take a demo ride and have an opportunity to win prizes, we had a voucher in every one of their bags for an extra one year warranty on an engine when they purchase an engine. Plus we turned around and had seminars with Ish Monroe, Takumari, and then we had our service guys back here doing basically maintenance 101 for the guys. Because we've had a few of them come through already with some issues on their engines. Just basic stuff that they're not aware that they should be doing. So it's, it's been great this evening. You know, what impresses me about the, the college anglers is their professionalism and their ability to do a lot of things that I wasn't able to do at that level. You know, um, they're understanding the business a whole lot more, knowing that they need to have business degrees and taking public speaking. And, and those are things that I knew, but they, they're, they're a step above. And, and then their fishing ability, you know, that's what it is. And so between their fishing ability and their professionalism, it, that's definitely what's got me uh, excited to see what's going on in the sport. Being who I am in the sport, it, it's great to give back, you know, and it's great to see these kids, and I get to relive my youth a little bit, you know, at the same time of being out here, so it's it's pretty cool event to be at, and I'm, I'm really having a lot of fun, you know, and, and that's what I've kind of gotten into these last couple years with fishing is, is having fun, and, you know, being out here with these guys, it's fun, and it's enjoying, and, you know, Alabama's done great here down in Florence at Pickwick Lake with the, the weather's been great. I guarantee the fishing's going to be awesome, and so it's definitely going to be a good time. These guys enjoy fishing, enjoy the tournament, enjoy to be out here, you know. They come all over the country, they're having a good time, you know, that kind of like attitude really, you know, refreshed my mind. You know, I, I get so much compassion on a professional tour, it's sometimes you kind of like a little too intense. But, uh, you know, nice weather out here, talking to those students, I really enjoy it. The students are able to pick the brains of Yamaha pros Ish Monroe and Takahiro Omori and get their boats serviced by Yamaha master technicians and Ranger support crew. On top of that, they're treated to a pizza party, demo rides, and tons of prizes. 
We'll be right back with more coverage of the nation's largest and most prestigious collegiate bass fishing event, the 2012 Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship. The Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship Series is brought to you by Boat U.S. For the love of boating. Cabela's, world's foremost outfitter. Garmin. Yamaha Marine. Reliability starts here. Before you head out here, get ready at Cabela's. Your source for the hottest new gear at tough to beat prices. Save big on everything you need when you shop by catalog, stores, and online at Cabela's.com. Our legendary selection is field tested and field proven. You can trust our gear. Cabela's, world's foremost outfitter. We invented and patented the first aerated live well. We're first with higher flotation standards, first to receive a protected design hull copyright, and we're still the only boat with the strength of a solid fiberglass transom. With such a strong focus on non-stop innovation, no other boat enjoys such advanced engineering. Ranger Boats, we're celebrating 40 years of fishing and a lifetime of leadership. Discover Yamaha's VMAX power. When you want the best, choose Yamaha. Garmin says their new Echo Fish Finders are simply the best fish finders for the money. I'll echo that. Right. Garmin also says you'll be impressed with the Echo Fish Finder's excellent power, screen clarity, and free transom and trolling motor mounting kit. I'll echo that. A nice, uh, bass. I'll echo that. Oh. 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 Why is it looking at me? never seen a hook like this. What I thought was good before is not so good now. The first surgically sharpened fish hook. This is the best ever. In test after test, we have proven that anyone can set this new hook with half the effort of any other hook. That's money. Introducing the Trocar hook, a weapon for fishermen who aren't just out to catch fish, but are out to win. Welcome back to Florence, Alabama, the official host city of the 2012 Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship. After morning practices in the famous Pickwick Lake, the registration begins with a sponsor reception hosted by 20 very involved corporate entities. I think college bass fishing okay, is okay. continuing to impress everybody in the industry with its rate of growth. And, uh, you know, from, from Ranger's standpoint as a company, we want to be a part of that. We want to be involved. Um, we do feel like you are seeing the next generation of anglers, the next generation of tournament pros, TV personalities are, are coming through these ranks. The level of angler that comes to this event is so above and beyond any other events in the country that, I mean, we are really lucky to be a part of this group of guys and to be a part of this tournament. This is the big one. I mean, look at people that have fished here in the past. They're some of the best upcoming pros. They're the best pros that there are now, and they've, they, they started here. We see this as a way to promote them to promote the careers that they aspire. I mean, they're, they're taking, I mean, not only are they taking a full loaded class, but they're taking this as a sport that they want to engage in and get into, and they aspire to be like the rest of the pros. Some of these guys are going to be the next Kevin Van Dams of the industry, um, and I think that's what's exciting is seeing them right as they're growing at this level, and uh, hopefully in a few years we'll, we'll start to see some of these guys uh, really nail it on the big time. Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass put on an excellent event. You know, we, we couldn't ask for better as collegiate anglers. You know, not just the hospitality of the people down here in Florence, but, you know, being able to come down and, and get some of these baits and hats and, and, and just everything that you guys do is, is superb. Collegiate fishing is an avenue for, for fishermen to go different directions. Some step in and, and fish professionally, 
And for me, it was an opportunity to, to work in the industry, which I really appreciate. And, you know, it could ultimately lead into a, to an avenue to compete later down the road. We're not here to put a hard sell on them. We're here to encourage them, uh, have these guys go after it as hard as they can, day in and day out, and really just pursue their dreams. And we want to support them and, and do everything we can to help them do that. It's unbelievable. I mean, there's so many sponsors here that, I mean, giving us free stuff. and. I mean, then the pros. I mean, last night you had Ish and Takahiro, and then today you walk through here, you see Jeff Creek, Casey Ashley, G-Man, and I mean, that's awesome. I've been fortunate enough to be a part of this thing since the start for maybe six, seven years now, and, and I've watched this thing go from like 40 teams to now close to 200. You know, college bass fishing has gotten huge. It's always been the greatest tournament atmosphere it's, that we go to each year. We've had an awesome time the past three years. This is our fourth year to fish it. Had a fun time in Louisville. Florence has been awesome. People are great, the city's fun. Oh, that's fantastic. I mean, just to walk in there and get all that stuff, that, that's unbelievable, you know, that, that people were willing to do that for us and sponsors, it's, it's great. This is a heck of an event you guys put on for us. Um, it's cool meeting everybody from out of state and out of, from different parts of the nation, and it's just awesome. Last time we thought, that tournament was big, but to come in and yesterday uh, at the, the Yamaha night and just like four or five rows, just of tons of other uh, students. So it was a pretty impressive event. <laughs> We've been a part of the Boat US Collegiate Fishing since its beginning. Um, it's so exciting to see it growing and evolving into the sport it is now. Um, the anglers getting excited about it, so we're excited to be here. and. Um, being a part of that growth and we're excited to see where it goes and what it can become of it. It's just great. You know, it's an awesome tournament. It's by far my favorite event to fish throughout the year and uh, it's probably the most prestigious win on the college fishing circuit. These young men and women have got to be excited just at the opportunity to come here and fish, much less walk through the doors and see, you know, 15 sponsor tables set up with just piles of free goods and gift cards and, you know, oh shopping God. trips and all that sort of thing. and. I mean, it's, you know, I, I, I wish I was doing it. You know, I wish I was on the other side of the table sometimes. Uh, everything's going on today, it's, it, I mean, it's awesome. All, the, uh, all of our sponsors and stuff really step up big time. They always do every year. The magnitude of which, you know, this has grown since I first started is just amazing, you know. They're out here doing what they love to do, and uh, it's great to see, you know, people following their passion, you know, from, from people that are just out here for fun or people out here that want to make a career out of it. And uh, whatever it, it is that they choose to do in life, you know, they're, uh, they're following their passion, and that's great. You know, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for our sponsors and the sponsors of the ACA. You know, this event couldn't be what it is without uh, help from the Boat US, without help from TBF and all those different organizations and companies that put so much forward. And uh, it's a big thanks goes to them for sure. All collegiate anglers receive tremendous support from sponsors, but Chris Splann from University of Missouri seems to have more than just sponsor support. My parents uh, and my girlfriend came down, uh, surprised me. Uh, they had a big sign with my first fish ever caught. I was three years old. Walk through the doors, you know, it's great to see uh, your family surprising you and let alone your girlfriend that you're missing. Um, so it's awesome, you know. Uh, this will be the first time that they've seen me uh, basically compete at this level, um, and it's great to have that support. Dinner Banquet is provided by NBC Sports Network, the ACA television partner, and students get a chance to meet reigning Forest Wood Cup champion Scott Martin. The professionalism, the way they look, the way they're representing themselves in their school, what a great opportunity for the sport of bass fishing down the road. When we have collegiate anglers, these guys are going to go on to be heads of boards, running companies, big executives, and they love the sport of bass fishing, and they're growing up in it. So what a wonderful opportunity, 5, 10, 15 years down the road, to have more corporate involvement just from these anglers today. When we come back, we'll show you around our host city, Florence, Alabama, and tell you why Pickwick Lake is known to be the hottest lake in the southeast right now.
Since 1996, Frog Togs Outerwear have kept outdoorsmen warm and dry, even in the worst of conditions. Now, Frog Togs have expanded beyond hunting and fishing markets and revolutionized the industry with their patented fabric system. Frog Togs are extremely lightweight and portable. They pack easily in your car, boat, RV, and even on your motorcycle. Best of all, Frog Togs are 100% waterproof and windproof, and yet extremely breathable. Check us out online at frogtogs.com. Frog Togs, stop the rain. Here at Cedar Creek Lake, we got a cooler full of nice crappie, just like this one. We're gonna go back and fillet him with the bubble blade. Hello guys, my name's Chuck Rollins. I'm with BigCrappie.com Guide Service. We're using a bubble blade to clean all of our fish now. We've stopped using the electric knives. I'll tell you why we like these guys. One, I've gotten quicker with this than I was my electric one. I would recommend bubble blade to anyone who cleans a lot of fish. You can bust right through the rib cages with these blades because they're so rigid. And but these flexible ones are they'll bend also so you can clean these smaller fish. Now, the reason I like these bigger blades is they give me a lot of leverage. Once I get in a roll and I start cleaning a lot of fish, if I've got 60 or 80 fish up here to clean, and you can push this through those bones a lot faster than you can push that electric knife through them. I picked up a bubble blade about four months ago and I'm sold on it and that's that's all I use now. Second to you again, bud. Tell you what, next tournament, I won't use my hydroway. I don't believe you, so you know what, bud? I'm taking it with me. Go ahead. Thanks, bud. You know what, Kevin? You know, he actually may be pulling for me. He's nuts if he thinks I'm giving up my hydrowave. What a squirrel. <laughs>
and uh, it's just good to kind of fish something different and you know hopefully it'll work out for us this time. I love this it, place. It's unlike anything we've ever fished. You, right now, at this time of the year, you can fish deep, you can catch them shallow, and it's just awesome. Uh, I've never fished any place like this before. Uh, it kind of reminds me of the Arkansas River, but it's a lot clearer, kind of like the lakes we have in Arkansas. And like he said, you can do anything you want and catch fish. There's a ton of fish in this lake. Come to Florence. We promise you'll have fun. You'll see lots of history. You'll have great food and wonderful entertainment. The Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship is the marquee event of three tournaments hosted as part of the Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship Series that includes the Cabela's Big Bass Bash and Pepsi Open. These no-entry fee events are open to all full-time students of university-recognized fishing programs. In addition to prizes and bragging rights to best of the best, students are also competing for points in the coveted ACA School of the Year race, which is the first college rankings program to recognize the top collegiate fishing teams in the country, taking into account their participation across all leagues. We're number one right now at School of the Year. I think we're 160 points, if I'm not mistaken, somewhere around there. Each tournament we come to, we come to the mindset we're gonna win it. You know, we've, we've had some good luck, myself and Evan here in the last couple months and so you know I'm hoping it sticks with us and uh, I hope he's got his lucky bobber with him. <laughs> In the college fishing world Arkansas Tech is pretty much a nobody you know and then you know us being ranked and being ranked first and being in the national spotlight pretty much all year long um, I mean it's just it's total bragging rights for us. The Arkansas guys like I said they're they're around 150 points ahead of us but that's by no means the only thing that we need to uh, Look out for it. We've got to beat Tech. Oh, well, yeah. There's, they're on some fish. We've been talking. We're all, <laughs> we're all from the same state. We share a little bit of knowledge, you know. We keep it friendly, but, yeah, we want to win. I'm sure they want to beat us just as bad as we want to beat them. Yeah. We're, we're kind of toying with each other. It's, uh, it'd be a fun conversation to sit down and listen There's, there's to a lot of mind games going on. <laughs> I know. You can. We're all on fish, though, and we all know it. It's yeah. just who can come up with the biggest load of crap to put into the next guy's head. So. If you're interested in becoming a part of collegiate fishing, then check out the Boat U.S. Collegiate Championship Series. Visit our website, find the latest tournament results, and watch previous TV shows. The countdown begins. We'll continue the coverage of the 2012 Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship. It was hard when I was lying in the hospital and didn't know if anybody survived pancreatic cancer that I decided, if I survive this, I want to offer hope to somebody else. To find out more about our unique treatment options for complex and advanced stage cancer, go to CancerCenter.com. You'll be able to see our treatment results for many types of cancers and how they compare to national averages. You can also check for participating insurance plans. Cancer Treatment Centers of America is different. It's state-of-the-art medicine, unique treatment options, and a level of compassion that cannot be copied. Why our people? People who give you not only their expertise, but their humanity and the most well-organized patient-centered care you'll find anywhere. Life is good and I just appreciate it totally. I'm doing things I never dreamt I would do. Every minute counts when you're fighting complex or advanced stage cancer. So please call or visit CancerCenter.com today. Appointments are available now. Cancer Treatment Centers of America. Care that never quits. Proven reliability is part of every Yamaha outboard. So we're starting off 2013 with Yamaha's Proven Reliability Sales Event. For a limited time, purchase an eligible new Yamaha outboard and choose between three years of Yamaha limited warranty coverage along with an additional two-year Yamaha extended service plan at no extra cost. Or take up to $2,000 in Yamaha credit toward the purchase of goods and services. Either way, if you're looking to have more fun on the water in 2013, now's your chance. Visit your local Yamaha Outboard dealer today. Since 1996, Frog Togs Outerwear have kept outdoorsmen warm and dry, even in the worst of conditions. Now, Frog Togs have expanded beyond hunting and fishing markets and revolutionized the industry with their patented fabric system. Frog Togs are extremely lightweight and portable. They pack easily in your car, boat, RV, and even on your motorcycle. Best of all, Frog Togs are 100% waterproof and windproof, and yet extremely breathable. Check us out online at frogtogs.com. Frog Togs, stop the rain. 
Freedom Live Action Hybrid Jigs. Designed with state-of-the-art technology that given the ability of the fishermen to easily customize the hook or bait to the actual presentation with an easy twist on and off snap, it gives the bait a free range of motion. Give more natural and realistic action. Bring fishing to the next level of enjoyment. Freedom Live Action Hybrid Jigs. For more information, go to freedomlures.com. The Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship Series is brought to you by Ranger Boats, still building legends one at a time. Cabela's, world's foremost outfitter. Hydrowave, ignite a feeding frenzy. Topwater clothing. Big Bite Baits, designed to bring the big bite to your line. Last year, University of Central Florida's Sonar Burgoff and Casey O'Donnell took home the title of the Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship. Man, you know what? The, the winning last year, it, it, was, it was actually a big surprise how big this event really is and how many doors can open for you. I mean, it's been a whirlwind ever since we won that event. And a lot of cool things have happened. We went to the TVF National Championship. I went to the All-American. And, uh, you know, to repeat, it would absolutely be amazing. It's, uh, it's an event that we hold in high regard and that we really enjoy it. And to, to win it two years in a row, I mean, with this kind of competition, that's going to be tough to do. High energy fills up the air at McFarland Park, the launch site of the 2012 Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship. Over 400 collegiate anglers are getting ready for day one of the most prestigious collegiate fishing tournament in the U.S. We got some spots here, you know, because it's our home lake. We got that advantage, just knowing the lake a little bit better than other people. But as far as number-wise, we're not catching that many numbers. We're just catching some bigger fish, and that's what we're hoping for, a big bite. Neither one of us have ever experienced anything like this. You know, it's always been local tournaments or UTC's tournaments, something like that. This is pretty big for us, and we're excited. We really want to do great. It's, it's a pretty big deal. I, I didn't quite expect all this. This is exciting. This is a big event. It's the biggest one we've ever been to. I'm looking forward to it. I've enjoyed it so far anyway. You know, I'm signed up through Boat U.S. Language Way to Win program. If I get up the lake and bust a 20-pound bag and what's the breakdown, you know, I've got the satisfaction of knowing that Boat U.S. will be there to tow me back in. And, hey, they're giving away $1,000 for this event, so I'm also eligible for that. You could really win big there. It's a really big lake. I've never fished one that was 66 miles long like this one is. And we fished on this end and had caught some small fish and went almost the other end. That's where we got into the big school fish. So we're going to make the run. That's all we can do and hope for the best. From what I'm hearing from the guys, you know, everybody's doing about the same thing, trying to catch them deep, but in all honesty, you can catch them about any way possible right now. The trick is just pulling up at the right time on the right ledge. We're feeling pretty good. We uh, struggled the first couple days of practice. We uh, put a real good pattern together. We're making a pretty good run. We feel pretty good about it. If you're interested in becoming a part of collegiate fishing, then check out the Boat US Collegiate Championship Series. Visit our website, find the latest tournament results, and watch previous TV shows. Plus, let us show you how to start a club at your school. The first thing you need to do is go to your school and make sure you have a team. If you don't have a team, start one, and if you do, join. And when you join, sign up for this tournament because this is the one that you want to come to. This is the, this is the show, man, it's awesome. This is the big show. Next week, we'll find out who'll catch a kicker to claim the title of the most fastest growing and largest <laughs> collegiate fishing in the nation. It's day one coverage of the 2012 Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship. Don't miss your opportunity to witness history in the making.